Hey YouTube, I'm going to be showing you how to make an uh, amplifier for your airsoft gun. That's, here's some two unfinished ones. This says you might, yeah, you do not know, but this is my third attempt at making this video. Because every single time I've tried, I've screwed up um, with my phone. So I'm going to use my crappy cra um, camera. As an example of my last video, the quality is way worse. But... Uh, I can't use my phone for a video that's going to be this long for a tutorial. So, what you're going to need. PVC pipe cutter. PVC pipe. PVC cap. And PVC pipe connector. Pencil. And electric drill with quarter inch drill bit. Okay. I'm going to show you this. Now, I'm just hoping you can see right here. Because it's all you need to see. Okay. Your cap. This is the most time consuming part of this whole project, but what you're going to do, just peel off the sticker. After you get the sticker off, which makes it look way nicer, you're going to mark the very center of this with a pencil. Now, with this cabbie camera, you probably can't see, but it says Nib Nibco 3 and quarter inch USA. The S in the USA is the very center of this cap, so just mark it. There it is. Then get your drill. Set it up right on top. Obviously, make sure it's in lined up. Hold on, now go slow. Otherwise, you need to screw this up. <coughs> okay, here we go. Ah, shit. Kinda messed up, but whatever. Well, that didn't work. Alright. Drop this stupid crap. Go out of So now you have a hole, obviously, but it is not as round as your barrel, which is about 14, is 14 millimeters, either positive or negative, will not matter. Now what you're going to need to do, as you can see, control, these ones, is it needs to get bigger, smallest one, medium size, bigger, you want it to be bigger than this too, so just keep, this is what you're going to do to make it bigger, it works well for me so far, just get your drill. Put it on, start, start, start drilling at an angle. Now, as you can obviously, obviously see, it's getting bigger. Now, you're just going to keep putting pressure on one direction. Try to get it centered more. You can see my dog's on the side, so I put more pressure over here. Try to make it go this way. And once you get this part completed, once it will put on, go onto your barrel and screw on, which you'll have to make sure it doesn't slide over the threads. Put it up to the threads and make sure it looks like it goes around the lowest part of the threads and make it just a little bit smaller. And then put it on and just start screwing it. The threads should be strong enough where it will um, thread this for you and then it'll just screw on nicely. Okay, get your PVC pipe. Mine's already pre-cut. Make it a little bit bigger than this. This is just a little bit small, but you make it this size if you want and just push it in. That's all. Then, get this piece. Now, on the pipe connector or whatever, has numbering or letters on one side. 
and it's blank on the other. Get the number inside and put that on the outside of your gun. So the flat side goes to the cap. Shit. See, that's why I want it to be a little bigger so it doesn't slide off. But there it is. That's still pretty snug. So you won't have to worry about it in there. Stop. If you can hear me. And once you have it on, just. There's your pop -up. Now, if you want to make it look like that, instead of having just a white one, which will look really cheap, what you can do is get spray paint. Uh, excuse me. You want to spray paint? Flat black works the best because it matches the, your gun. And then you're only going to spray the inside and the back. So, only the, this part, spray it, and the inside there. Then on the outside, ah, oh, fail. On the outside right here, obviously, you know, just wrap electrical tape. Now, as you can tell on my gun, that looks really nice. So, um, if you click on the link I'm putting in the video right now, it will bring you to the video where you can see how this thing sounds and how impressive it is for how cheap it's made. So now I have three silencers I've made. So, Obviously, now each one of these are 10 bucks. Um, it is cheap to make your own, but if you can't make your own, down the tools, 10 bucks, and that's only if you live in Chino Hills and you go to SC Village Paintball Park Airsoft. If you do not go there, um, well, you have to go make your own. And if you don't live in near Chino Hills, you have to go make your own. So, yep, that's how you make it. And let me just take some time to go over my beautiful gun, you know, because I have to. Okay, this is a custom built M4. It's not custom. It used to be a GG M4S system, but I I take out the stock, rewired it to the back, put a little sling mount, made a dual mag, which is not really custom. All internals have been changed except the gears. Um, I have this popper on it. I used to have a different sensor, which was um, a hollower, basically. That's, I call it a hollower. It doesn't have a real name to it. It's just a JBS sensor, but it makes the air just make a hollow sound, like if you're shooting. I don't know, it's just weird. It's awesome though. And then, sewage front sight, um, bipod grip. These are just the external parts. And then there's my battery holder. Uh, this helps a lot in game. I can tell, I two mags. You just pop them out, six mags. It's way faster, so when you're shooting, or an ammo, just pop down. And switch it over. You can shoot way faster than going into your vest or wherever you hold your ammo. So, yeah. And I built this little thing in it, if you can see it right now. Yeah, there's nothing really. Let's see that little sight I made in there. It doesn't really work at all, but it's cool. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. I'll have videos on how to take apart your gearbox, clean it out. Way better than the ones that I see, because the ones that I've seen when I first learned how to do it, they were horrible. They did not. They just did it, but they didn't explain each part and what it does. Like, it was just horrible, because I didn't know how to put in, like, the anti reversal latch. They never say anything about that, but I'll show you how to do everything perfectly. And it works every time. Okay, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. See you later.